The CQC, or the Care Quality Commission, are the independent regulator for all health and social care services in England. Their job is to make sure that care provided by hospitals, dentists, ambulances, care homes and services in people's own homes and elsewhere meets the national standards of quality and safety. They are funded through a combination of a registration fee, income and also government grant aid. The Care Quality Commission began to operate in the, on the 1st of April 2009 as the independent regulator of health and adult social care in England and it replaced three earlier commissions. These were the Healthcare Commission, the Commission for Social Care Inspection and the Mental Health Act Commission. They set the national standards cover all aspects of care including treating people with dignity and respect, making sure that food and drink meets people's needs, making sure that the environment is clean and safe and also making sure that staffing and servicing is correct. The CQC, Registered Care Services, that meet standards, inspect them to check that they continue to do so and take action when they don't. They use information they receive, particularly when it concerns are uh, related to abuse, harm or neglect, to monitor and report on care services. And they also ensure that everyone's complying with national standards. If they find any concerns, they refer, they refer those concerns to the local councils and maybe even to the police for further investigation. The CQC contribute to national safeguarding policies and making recommendations and being involved in multi-agency children's uh, safeguarding inspections so they get a picture of what's happening throughout the uh, care world. When standards are not being met, they can issue fines or warnings, stop admissions to a care service, and also cancel or suspend a care service registration. For more information on how the CQC works and all aspects of safeguarding in your work sector, have a look at the CQC website at www.cqc.org.uk and we've put a link on that in our download area on this Pro Trainings course.